Hi everyone, welcome to our channel Khan Academy. So today I am going to discuss about the cognigencey hiring process and cognigencey especially technical assessment. So we will talk about the uh, exact syllabus like what is the exact syllabus for the cognigencey technical assessment and what type of mail you are receiving. Okay. So first of all, like if you are getting the schedule, so uh, there will be like exact date when it will happen and this type of mail students will receive normally. Cognigen invites to take the technical assessment. Okay. Dear candidate, greetings from the Cognient. We are pleased to share that you have been shortlisted for the Cognient hiring technical assessment and the duration of the same is 120 minutes. So for the technical assessment, the total duration is 120 minutes and you have to complete the full assessment in 120 minutes. And technical assessment is very, very, very important assessment because uh, on based on uh, that assessment only, you are going to uh, receive the mails for the different, different profiles like Cognient, Gen C, Gen C Next and Gen C Pro. Now talking about the syllabus, so this is the exact syllabus and technical assessment is a mandatory assessment to further move your candidature ahead in the hiring process. So there will be different different clusters, okay. So cluster 1, cluster 2 and cluster 3. So on the basis of the cluster, you are going to give the technical assessment. So basically, if you like, uh, like if you uh, receive the assessment for the cluster 1 or cluster 3, so there will be different different sections. If you are from the cluster 1 or cluster 2, then different section cluster two cluster three different sections okay so first of all talking about the cluster one a syllabus the duration is totally same for the cluster one cluster two and cluster three and section will be also same like three section will be uh, there in the cluster one cluster two and cluster three okay so uh, first of all in cluster one what is the exact syllabus there will be three different section first section would be java programming that is coding second would be query and third would be coding okay so if you are giving the cluster one now there will be coding and cluster three there will be a coding more coding if you are from the cluster two now there will be less coding so this is one advantage from the cluster two so coding would be in java programming for the cluster one like you will solve the java programming like your questions will be there for based on the java programming so you have to solve the coding question on java and then two sql queries will be there the topics uh, ddl dml dcl tcl they are covering and after that coding coding based on the html css and javascript normally web based like they are giving some uh, like validations you have to create the one uh, create one phase like uh, based on the html css and javascript so you have to uh, write the web code right uh, javascript and html css so basically so this is the exact one so you have to write the code for web for java and sql so this is for cluster one if you are from the cluster two now then you have to write the code in python first section would be coding and you have to write the code in python second second would be query that is sql query is same two questions will be there and cloud fundamentals multiple choice question that will be very easy level right easy to medium level mcq will be there there will be no code for from the web UI and you have to solve the MCQ questions from the cloud uh, based okay multiple choice question you can see and the cluster 3 you have to solve the coding question in C sharp and uh, you have to like query uh, you have to do the query for the SQL like two queries will be there and again in the cluster 3 also coding will be there for the HTML CSS and JavaScript okay so this is the exact syllabus for cluster 1 cluster 2 and cluster 3 okay i hope you understand and how you are getting the cl clusters so based upon your profile sometimes like in your resume if you have mentioned like java and java related projects then definitely you will get the cluster one if you have like more knowledge in python also so it is also based upon the registration process and also based upon the resume also whatever whatever the profile is showing to the recruiter now they will assign the cluster so the basic doubt if you have any doubt now I will uh, like uh, link the video. I will uh, provide the link in description na, one video that you can watch that video full interview experience of one candidate. He will like she will provide the exact details so you can watch that one also. Now talking about the technical assessment uh, important point like section one coding okay that e, that I have mentioned already like DDML, TDL, SQL operation, joins the, these are the some topics that questions will ask some DSC questions, OOPS concept, file handling, array string you have to practice more for the uh, 
that one okay so technical assessment is also an elimination round guys uh, don't think that is not the elimination non elimination round this is the elimination round if you are not solving the questions if you are not shortlisted for this round he will not the you will not receive the interview mails okay so this is very important section and query database what you have to prepare you have to prepare like sql commands from the ddl dml dcl tcl so basically based upon that one only question will ask Understanding constant and their types, SQL operators, SQL functions, clauses and SQL joins in their types and subqueries and views and indexes. These are the some topics that you can prepare for the SQL queries. Okay. Now talking about the MCQ based, so Unix commands, cell scripting, data warehouse basics, ETL concept, cloud fundamentals. They are the some topics for the MCQ based, right? So MCQ based, you can prepare these concept. And if you want to prepare for the MCQ now, so this website placementpreparation.io MCQ you can prepare different different one. I hope you like this video. Anki videos mein aur bhi hanik se baane baat karenge. Thank you guys. Thanks for watching.